Today we're live at Liverpool's training ground, courtesy of Nike Football. I uh, want to say a massive thank you to Liverpool for the opportunity as well. But yeah, we've got VVD here today, we've got Hendo, we've got Robbo. Going to be asking them some questions, I've got the chat here as well. Yeah, here's the big man himself. Everyone in the chat's going wild to say, my captain Hendo, <laughs> Hendo, my skipper. How you doing? Good, you? Very good, very good. I can't lie, we missed you, man. And my heart sunk. My heart as well. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, my I'm, I'm, I'm very happy to be back. It's, um, I'm getting there, so uh, it's all good. Just taking your time. And well, no, I'm not, I'm not, hopefully, I want to be as quick as possible, but you know, the You're only thing quick. I can do. Just quick. You know, I saw you the other day. Like, yeah, no, I try, I try. So, um, no, I'm feeling good, man. Okay. That's good. Well, we're gonna get into some questions, right? At what age did you know you were going to be a professional footballer? <laughs> well, I was hoping from a very early age to become a professional football player. I think. Must have been when I was 10 or something that I just really dreamed about playing in the Premier League, yeah. winning the Champions League, playing for Holland, all these, all these things. So that was, that was a big dream of mine. And, um, but realistically, you know, I think when I was 17, you know, I wanted to, I was working to get my first contract. Yeah. So fortunately, didn't get at my first team. Uh, where, where I was for 10 years. Uh, you didn't get your first team, hey, they must be kicking themselves yeah. now. Well, you know, everything happens for a reason, so yeah. you know, I'm, I'm still very grateful for everything they've done, but you know, Asher Koning gave me the, uh, the chance, yeah. and um, everything uh, worked out pretty well. Yeah, yeah well, <laughs> <laughs> pretty well to say the least. How did you feel when you first signed for Liverpool? Uh, yeah, obviously, it was like uh, a whirlwind a couple of days, it was uh, a bit crazy. But um, you know, when you sign the contract, you're just delighted to be to be a part of this club, and, and that was definitely for me. Um, you know, it was you know the happiest couple of days. Um, it was certainly you're like, like pinching yourself and stuff. Yeah, I suppose. Yeah, you know, when like the thing is, is when these transfers come, you know, I've probably known about it a couple of weeks before when the clubs are negotiating. So you kind of, when it comes to signing, you're just like. Just get this done now, yeah, come on. Yeah, that's yeah, yeah. But um, yeah, look, signing for a massive club like that was a dream come true. So um, yeah, it was uh, it was a real happy time. How was it when you first signed for Liverpool? It was amazing to, to, to sign for this football club. You know, at the beginning, it was it was a dream come true. It was in a couple of years. It was tough. You know, I struggled. It was a lot of pressure on you. To yeah, be it, was, it, was a, it, was a, it was a lot of money at the time. Yeah, uh, for a, for a young. A young player, um, and I found it difficult. You know, I was playing, um, but performance level probably wasn't up to the, yeah. the standard that that no, could expect. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think back then, I think I was even one of those that was like, oh, I wanted to come and just take over Gerard and whatever. But <laughs> life isn't like that, innit? Like for you, obviously, you're human at the end of the day, so a lot of pressure on you. But credit to you, come through and just absolutely smashed it. So you silenced a lot of people, including myself at the time. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? And I think that's incredible. Thanks. Um, when you were awarded the captaincy, how did you feel? Did you feel like, were you shocked or did you expect it? Well, I was made vice captain for so um, that was that was when Stevie was still here. Yeah. Um, and that that helped us a little bit. But yeah, when when he left because I was vice captain, then I, I sort of had a, an, an idea that I would become captain eventually when he when he did when he did end up leaving. Um, but I think that period of being vice captain helped, you know, when he was injured or when he wasn't playing. Yeah. Then then I stepped in. So, I, so that, that's that really helped you yeah, 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 yeah. That's really yeah. Good. Can you describe what it means to play for a club like Liverpool? <laughs> you know, I'm just I'm just proud yes, to play for this club. First of all to play in the Premier League was already a proud moment for me, you know, my family. But, you know, playing for Liverpool, um, Going down in, in the history books of Liverpool, mm. with winning what we won so far, you know, it's already such a proud thing. And um, each and every day, each and every game, you know, is, is special. And Enfield, obviously, you know, yeah. the fans, the way the fans live and breathe Liverpool, you know, is something I, I really enjoy playing for. Uh, that, that, well, we enjoy watching you play as well. Like, well, how do you feel like when the fans like start singing your name and everything? It's like special, that? you know. It's special, you know. Uh, it's, it, it, it gives you extra, extra motivation, extra power. Not that you need it, but you know, it, 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 it is something that just comes. Not many centre backs get songs about defending and scoring. Well, so, you know, <laughs> there, I need to score, score start scoring again, though, to be fair. But um, no, yeah, it's 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 nice, and um, I won't take it for granted. Um, 
like no one should take our team for granted as well. Yeah, I think it's something special going on, um, and uh, you know, we should appreciate it. Getting man of the match in your first game must have been an unreal feeling. Can you explain what that was like? Yeah, it was you know, it was unbelievable. I remember it. Um, you know, loved just obviously your debut being at Anfield, being the first Premier League game there that season. It was uh, it was special. And to get man of the match, to get to get that was uh, was an incredible feeling. And um, you know, I certainly um, you know enjoy enjoyed that game. I think enjoyed. you look like you enjoy every game though. When I watch shoes, <laughs> like you're darting around, and my eyes are like pinging around the pitch. Yeah. Like, you just don't seem to stop, like, especially that one against City when you've gone from there to there. <laughs> yeah, like, that's the button that always gets brought up, but, um, look, games is, games is what you get paid for. I love, I love playing games, you know, um, you know, I like playing games, that's, you know, that, that's what you want to be playing football, you know, training, training's great, don't get me wrong, but yeah. it doesn't replicate games, do you yeah. know what I mean? And, um, you know, when it comes to the, when it comes to the big stadiums, when it comes to the big matches, then, you know, I just, you know, I love running about and, and, and just trying to enjoy every game possible. Being the first captain to win the league in 30 years, how did it finally feel? Incredible. Yeah, incredible, incredible moment. Unfortunately, obviously, it wasn't with fans, which yeah. is a little bit disappointing, but we waited so, so long. Um, to be able to do it, yeah, so yeah. it would have, would have lifted it anywhere. That was the one thing that people always said to me about being a Liverpool fan. Oh, like, where's your Premier League? Like, you ain't got the Premier League though. And we won it, we smashed it, to be fair. And um, have you seen the stuff about around, like, you lifting the trophy and your little the shuffle? Like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so we'd done, I think it was after Champions League, you know, I'd done that. And uh, from that point, um, we won a few more trophies and every time the lads, the lads and a few other people just said yeah. that if you win and you lift the trophy, you need to do the shuffle. So it ended up becoming like a little thing. Yeah, that's quality. Yeah. What was your first game like back from injury? Because injuries like happen in football a lot, but there's injuries that when you come back from, you feel a bit different. Like you're not quite yourself. Because you know I mean? yeah, so obviously I didn't go to the Euro, so I had a proper off season in uh, in Portugal mm. with, with the physio and my physio and worked very hard. But obviously you can't replicate what you gonna. You know, face and training yeah. with other players, yeah. um, all these things. So when I reported back for preseason in in Austria, I was a bit nervous. Yeah. I was a bit nervous, but nervous in the way that how is he gonna feel? How is he gonna react? Yeah, because that's the, those questions you can't. You don't know to me exactly. Going, so yeah. some people might not even know like your journey leading up to being a Champions League winner, which is incredible. Did you ever think that was gonna be a thing that you you could win the Champions League? Yeah, if I said yeah, I'd be lying. You can't, you can't say, you can't say yeah to that. Look, when I was younger, I was, I was like, I want to be a professional footballer. I mean, I was, yeah. that was my dream. That was, you know, I was a big Celtic fan when I was younger. I wanted to play with Celtic. That was my dream. Mm. But beyond that, I wanted to play with Scotland, of course, because I knew that was my country. But uh, you can't say uh, I knew I was going to play for Liverpool or I knew I was going to win the chip because nobody and knows that. It's yeah. impossible. And maybe trend Scotland as well. Yeah, yeah. Look, captain of Scotland's the you know one of the biggest honours, and to be able to play for your country, never mind the captain of the country, was huge. So I always wanted to do that. I, I knew I could, but you know I couldn't see how. How I think I was going to win the Champions yeah, League. Yeah. I just wanted to become a professional footballer, and I, I just tried my best to, to be able to fulfil that. That's credit to you. Like, that's <laughs> your journey as well is incredible. Like you said, the captain of your country as well. You must get like feel an incredible uh, sense of responsibility on your shoulders as well. Yeah, I do. It's yeah, like a whole nation on <laughs> you and yeah. All right, all right. <laughs> <laughs> just to remind me, in case you forgot. No, but um, like uh, you know, as I've now been captain for uh, four years, I think now, and I've got better to deal with that. I think at the time when I first became captain, we were going through a really rough patch in terms of not getting the results we needed and things like that. And I think I took too much on board. I was trying to sort everything. Um, but now it's, you know, I'm a, I'm a lot better for it. I'm a lot more experienced captain. I believe I'm a lot better captain now. Um, so it's important to, you know, know what you can control, know what you can't control. But being captain, you know, I love it. I love being able to, you know, lead out your country, lead out the boys, you know, represent your country, whatever it is, and, you know, going to major tournaments and stuff. So the, you know, that was that was yeah, the maximum for me, and um, you know, it's an incredible feeling. Um, how's fatherhood been for you? <laughs> Amazing. Listen, fatherhood is, you know, it's, it's, the, it's the best, the best in my opinion. Um, I just recently became a father as well, so. Did you? Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. Little boy? 
Yeah, almost five months. Oh, well done to you. Yeah, it's tough though. Well I'm done not gonna lie. Oh, yeah, I've got three girls. Ooh. So um, no, I think it's it's the real world. Yeah. You know, I think um, you know they give you so much back. For example, how I see it as well. If I have a tough game or a tough day or. Let's keep it in the football. If I have a tough game, we lose or we draw or, or I, I had a mistake or something, yeah. and go home. You know, nothing else matters. Yeah. I see them, they smile, and, and, and that's... It's a humbling feeling. You like Nothing else is important at that moment when well, they smile. Yeah. In the end of the day, nothing is important. Yeah. It's only them. Yeah. Your family, you know, yeah. you're, you're in, in this case, your kids. So I'm uh, really, really grateful for my, uh, for my family, for my wife, for my kids. So. Um, that's good. Family's important. In your time off, like when you chill and relax, like what what do you go to do? Like what, what's your main thing? Um, just spend time with your family, with the kids. Yeah. You know, I'm away from them quite a lot, so I don't see them that often. Um, especially with like, the week times that we train and stuff. Yeah. Um, so I try to spend as much time as them with them um, when I can. Do you get frustrated at home? Like, oh, dad, watching football, talking about football. <laughs> well, no, that's what, that's what I mean. I've got two girls. And I've got a little boy, um, so he doesn't really understand. Like, yeah, he's only like one and a half. So, uh, but the girls are like starting to like ask questions. Yeah. And, like, did you win the day? And little yeah. things like that. So, it's nice. It's nice. Did, did you see the thing before? Like, I don't know if it was before you joined the or not, but the whole boring James Milner account. Yeah, I've seen boring James. Milner. Yeah, like when I met Milner, I thought he was going to be boring because. So did that? Yeah. I walked in the shade room thinking, oh, I can't be bothered with this guy. <laughs> and then like first day he's like coming for me and stuff, I'm like, really? this isn't boring James Milner. <laughs> nah. But um, no, Millie's, you know, I think Millie's, I, I don't know who started that account, I still love the account. It is actually right? really funny. <laughs> yeah, and then yeah. he's actually quite funny himself. He's, I think he, I think boring James Milner accounts lost a couple of followers since <laughs> Millie's came on it, like, because Millie's, <laughs> Millie's social media is good to be fair to him. So I, I'd say, I'd say me and Millie. I'd say me and Millie are probably the most loudest and liveliest to me. Yeah. And who's it? I feel like in the dressing room there's always someone that's like the centre of the jokes in terms of you poking fun at them. Who is that? Um, Endo gets a wee bit. Endo? Well, yeah, yeah, I, I, is it for the hair gel or something? Uh, I, I, go, I go for Endo for a bit. Go for, the, go for the biggest one. Go for the captain, no problem. Go for Virgil sometimes. Um, Ox. Ox gets a wee bit, but Ox can give it back. Ox yeah. is very good at yeah, you know, quick jokes. replies. Yeah. And you just go, nah, he's, he's caught me off guard there. Um, yeah, I'd say Mo. I Man. go for Mo a lot. I go for Mo. I like winding up Mo, but Mo likes winding up me. So he, he tries it in different ways, but you know, Mo, like, he's obviously you know, the best player that we're one of. You know, I'd say the best player in the world right now. So I yeah. thought, yeah, you know, perfect example. Just take the mickey out of him. Yeah. <laughs> go for him. Um, question I know you guys play a lot of table tennis <laughs> how are you at table tennis because we're about to go over and play some ping pong table tennis whatever you want to call it I'm okay you're okay no! <laughs> <laughs> are you serious okay. are you, you know who's the best in this team Who? Mo Everyone said that. I was trying to watch yeah, the well, tournament he's, before. Yeah, he's, he's okay. You might have to get him up for a game or something one time. Don't want he got the little... <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah, he, he got it. That's but, crazy. Um, I won't say I'm bad, but... Um, I don't know like the rules that I play like or I've just like really... I know they I don't want know. to. I know they want to. Yeah, yeah I, I, don't I, don't know, I don't know the serving rules <laughs> and stuff. You know what I mean? I just no, sort I, of I, do it. I know they want to. Who's the best at table tennis? Verge said Mo. Mo? Yes, Mo's, Mo's good. Yeah, more is good. I heard win three years in a row kind of good. <laughs> yeah, but doubles. Doubles, ah. Uh, who's his partner on it? Was me once as well. Ah, so okay, so you are a winner as well. We're getting into the nitty gritty uh, now. I'm, I'm not looking forward yeah. to playing this one. <laughs> so. And uh, speaking of Mo, apparently he's the best at table tennis ping pong, whatever you like to call it. Um, where do you rank yourself? Oh. I, I will tell you one thing, you'll be a lot lower if you lose to me. And we're going to go over and play some, so. Top 10 in the squad. Top 10, but it's not great. I'd say people that are ahead of me that I can't argue. I'm better than Virg. Are you? Yeah. That's a problem because he beat me. Nah. But I think he'd have been practicing for this. He's that type of guy that knows that this is what yeah, he's yeah, 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 I mean, I'm yeah. a bit rusty. coming on I'm a humble flex, but I know. Not had a good night's sleep. Not yeah. yet. Do you know what I mean? I've not had. Um, Hendo's good. Moore's good. Trent's good. Trent's mad competitive, isn't he? Aye. Aye. Like you, you end up just feeling sorry for Trent. Do you know what I mean? You end up just hitting the ball up to him and like, go on, win. Like, I don't want to upset you, do you know what I mean? Trent, come on. Um, I'm trying to think because we had a table tennis table in France in pre season, we had a lot of games. Yeah. Me and uh, Cueve, the goalkeeper, Kelleher, we had a lot of games. It was 
close, but I came up the other hand. Joe Gomez, Bad. knackered. Really? After, nah, rubbish, rubbish. And then. Joe's um, drawing you out. Oh. So I'm probably top five, it could be. You're top five? Well, I'm, 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 I'm trying to name people that are. How about Alison? Just, when I get rhythm. Surely Alison's got to be good. Nah, he's not great. Really? Nah, he's not great. Bobby? Bobby's got this weird, like, takers. But it doesn't really work. It doesn't really work. He goes like this, like, it's as if he's like. <laughs> Ready to do this unbelievable serve, and then he just goes like that and it hits the net. And it's like Bobby, after all that, it's not worth it. Do you know what I mean? Just go like that and serve the ball. That's but so funny. I'm not. I'm. I'm not great. I'm. Do you know what I am? I'm safe. Uh, so they all get frustrated at me. Yeah, I'm, that's, giving, that's I'm me. giving you too much. I'm, I'm giving you too okay, much. Okay, well, let's head me. over and have a little bit of a game. Come on then. See how you do. Hey, yeah, we need to have the ball. The ball's sure? Yeah, yeah, listen, this ball, we can't do it properly, I'll tell you now, seriously. Okay, okay. I'm helping you as well. <laughs> you want good content, you need to <laughs> <laughs> have a good ball, you know? <laughs> one no. Yeah, it's one nil. Don't get beaten by me, I'm telling you. you, you listen, listen, I'll tell you now, you're not gonna win. I'll tell you now. <laughs> I'll tell him now, right now. Why am I not gonna win? I'll tell you now. I know. Because you know I'm short, innit? That's what I'm at. <laughs> no, I haven't got that. Hey, okay. Ah, no. Yes, 3 2. It's the ball. <laughs> oh my goodness. No. <laughs> You've got a quick turn there, though. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to challenge Mug soon. He got some I'll see you. He said quickly, man. He said quickly. bring him up. So who else, man? I will, I will put myself up there, you know? Yeah. Yes. Oh! Yeah, I think I'll put you up there. Bro, why does your hair still stay so slick during games? I don't know, man. Blessed, you're blessed. Do you use like a gel or something? Hey! No. Oh. 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 <laughs> 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 you just you just hit the table. Yeah, no, it's no, fine. No, no, it's fine. fine. So you can't hit the table. I told you I don't know the rules like that. You can. You can. Yeah. Seven six. I'm not doing too badly to be honest. You look really well, bro. It's the ball. Oh, no, I can't, you can't come with that. Yay! No, you're pretty. You're pretty. Mm -hmm. You're the nicest guy, but you're also pretty. Mm -hmm. Nah, man. No, man. Money, man. I'm trying to do it for you guys. Money, man. <laughs> oh, that's oh, that's the last touch. Yeah, okay. Oh, that's the last Yeah, I'm just all that. I like oh. it when clean, you know what I mean? Hey! Yes. Oh. Hey, bro! No, you. What? Oh, oh, no way! That's right, that's right! You thought it was bounced, huh? Yeah, yeah. You ready? Yeah. Oh! One, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Now you don't play this too much, bro. That's what you do in your spare time. Nah, do it. Nah, nah, nah. You lot are too good at this. Nah. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Both good. Oh, 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 we're pulling it back. It's that ball. Just needed interesting for the cameras. <laughs> <laughs> oh, why? I tried to copy what you did. Oh. Ah. Six four. I don't like the way you are sending me across the table. You are moving. I'm not going to do it. Oh, money! Yeah. That's it, that's one. Oh! How did you make that? Oh, no! I should have 
sneak here and do all the points I can get. Oh, good five. Yo, why are you always sizing it up to smash it? I see it. Oh, Manny. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get one of these. I need to get one of these tables. <laughs> oh, oh did that clip man. it? Is that really how you lost? Did that clip it? <sighs> Alright, let's do some connect before. We are absolutely d disgusting. Wow. Oh, wow. It is quite hard actually though. Now that's off target. Oh no! Yeah, there he is. Oh, I just keep praying it though. No, I'm 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 I told you before, I don't, I'm going to try win. this side. I'm going to try I, this side. I don't win dirty, I win cleanly. This is the one. You want to see it? Oh my god. Nah, 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 watch. Oh no, it's just going off the edge. Wow, you oh, just threw it no I'm reason. Bad. I'm bad. We're gonna be here all day. Wow. We're gonna be here all day. It's brush. I'm rushing it, I'm rushing it, I'm rushing it. You won! Oh my alright, cool. You know what? I I'm not gonna beat you in anything. Not even in a race. Bounce it in. Right. Myself and Virgil weren't really good at it. Right. Oh! Yeah, nah, too much. Get, I'm just getting used to the tier, but yeah. They're better than the um, ping pong balls. They're bouncing. It's a lot harder than it looks. Mm, it is actually. Alright, you've gone for the double one, have you? Uh, ooh, stocking you as well. Three or four. Some of you are end up. Ah, nice. Yes. Clocking it. Come on, let's see it, man. Oh, wow. Oh, no. What happens now in a second? No, it's eight again. What? No, no, what's going on? What's in the middle? What's in the middle? What's in the middle? I need that top one. I need that top one. Don't you dare. Nah. Don't you dare skip on. Don't you dare. Oh, come on. Hey. I don't know how I'm winning Go on. here. You've got, oh, you've got a few options there, haven't you? I'm going to have to. You have to get that one. No. Oh. This is it. This is it. This is it. Oh, you've killed it. Are you being serious? Blocked this? No, I've helped you. Oh, come on, man. If I don't win this, this is embarrassing. What am I doing? You can't win, really. Have I run out of balls? You stopped me one way. Um, yeah. <laughs> no. This is a draw, then. It's a draw. Done. Fair enough. Quick fire. Are we just going to talk about what just happened? Or no, no, I don't want to talk about it. I, I, I don't want to talk about it, but I personally. Okay. Would like to move on. You know what I mean, yeah, I don't okay, like. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Quick fire questions. Low tops or high tops? Low tops. All day. Low. Kanye or Drake? Drake. Thank Drake. you, my guy. Come on. Drake. Good, the man in the top. Scoring for club or scoring for country? Scoring, the, I don't know. Both. I, I, uh, I can't I, listen. No, I'll allow you on that one because okay. I know you, you'll get yeah, judged for yeah. that one for real. Yeah, exactly. Virgil didn't want to answer. I can't give us that one. <laughs> Alright, um, no, I let him skip that one. I let him I don't skip score many for me currently. I've only scored one, so. But, nah, I can't. Both. Yeah, yeah, yeah. R9 or Ronaldinho? Ronaldinho. Yeah, my guy. Yeah, Ronaldinho. Ronaldinho is the reason why a lot of people want to play football, definitely. <laughs> Brilliant, that. Um, Ronaldinho. But I do love R9. Yeah. Basketball or American football? Basketball. Basketball. One player you'd love to play with? Ronaldinho. What? Any uh, past present, Virgil Sardinia. Yeah, yeah, let's go with it. Go with Valdinho. Uh, it's a Dan. It's a Dan. Go with Dan. Ooh, yeah, yeah, that's yeah. a nice one. Most difficult player you've come up against? I would say Lionel Messi. Difficult, um, Modric or Dembele. 
Usman Dembele. Musa. Musa Dembele. Oh, mm. Musa Dembele. He was a good player. Yeah, yeah. Good player. Favourite movie? American Gangster. Probably Shawshank. What's your go-to like comfort food? Um, rice, veggies and chicken. Pizza. What, 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 what kind of pizza? Margarita. Is pineapple and pizza a thing? No. Okay. <laughs> Tom, 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 honestly, you cannot happen. It uh, can't happen. Are you pineapple on pizza? I, I wouldn't go out my way to have it if it was the nah, only thing I could have hand on it. Favourite vacation spot? Maldives. Oh, I'd say Portugal, but that's just because we go with the kids a lot. Um, <laughs> somewhere I've never been and I've heard is amazing and I really want to go with Maldives. Ah, uh, yeah, everyone yeah. wants to go there. Yeah. Favourite actor? There's a Washington. Denzel. Yes. Virgil said that as well. Yeah. All, 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 all Leonardo DiCaprio. Ah, uh, okay. So go with them too. Good one. Uh, favorite artist? Um, Drake is up there. I love a lot of music. Man. It's got to be Drake. You know? Drake is at the moment, like he's that. generational. He's, he's from this era. He's he's, he's uh, one of the best of this era. So I would say, I would say. Alicia Keys. Ooh, I did not see that coming. What are you saying? No yeah. Hey. Mm, okay. Okay. Air Force or Air Jordan? The Air Jordan of Travis Scott are fire. Yeah. I would say Air Jordan. Okay. Air Jordan. One superpower. Have one superpower, what would it be? Be invisible. Invisible? Mine's teleportation. Invisible, what uh, can you do? Well, you c I can go anywhere then. Yeah, but. Nah, nah teleportation. Uh, this is hard, this. <laughs> <laughs> Flying. Flying? Where are you going to? Maldives. <laughs> <laughs> just fly. Will you fly everywhere? Wouldn't you? Like, if you're like, like in, in a traffic jam, you just fly off. Nah, I said teleportation. Virgil said invisibility. So, what are you going to do with that? Imagine you're locked in a room and you want to get out. You can teleport. What's invisible? Well, he's going to be invisible. <laughs> Maybe because he stands out and everybody <laughs> constantly <laughs> can see him, so he doesn't want to be seen. Okay, uh, favourite superhero? Black Panther. Um, okay, that's a good one. Um, one player you choose to choose to be sta stranded on an island with? One player? Yeah, if you could choose one player to be stranded. One that's not going to annoy you would probably be the best bet. Well, it, well, it depends on who you look at this. Who's going to get you off the island? James Milner. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. <laughs> However, if you want someone to have a good time on the island and just chill and not be thinking about getting off and just... Yeah. I'd probably go Verge, to be fair. Yeah, Virgin's really chill, super chill, chill yeah. guy, yeah. He'd have, like, like, he'd just be chilling, like, sunbathing with a coconut or something, just, yeah, he'd be, he'd be a good guy to chill with, I think. Best footballing memory as a child, leave that as the last one. I remember going going to school, mm. the Ronaldinho's white and gold tiempos yeah. in futsal yeah. with jeans. Oh, so oh wow. wow. Yeah. You know, was, do you know about the meme that people say footballers yeah, play in jeans listen. sometimes and say yeah. that, like, yeah, okay, they're was not, like, agile. So you literally did play in yeah, jeans? Listen, I played in jeans. Because obviously, it's a school day, yeah. but you know you had a break of like a half an hour. Yeah. And you wanted to show that you were, you know, you could play football. <laughs> I beg you to so find me. us a picture listen, of So, I want to have them train us back, so Nike will go back. As a child? I'm going to ask you the what? same thing that I asked Virgil. Were you what? one of those guys that scored like five goals in a game and that's how you got scouted? <laughs> that, that's um, the story for a lot of footballers. Yeah, to be fair, I used to score quite a bit when I was a kid. I was a striker, so like from, sc striker. from my school and that, I was I was a striker, so I used to score some some goals. The older I got, the less I scored, really. Yeah, that seems to be the case now. But the, um, the memory, like watching football, playing football, watching football. Mike Lawn, England, always stands out. You know, the World, was it World Cup of Euros, Argentina. No, but that might be ninety eight. Yeah, that that, that goal for for England stands out for us as a kid. Um, about the five one Emil Heskey and that. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> We've got some signed shirts here. Um, make sure you look out on Twitter, my Twitter, um, for some of that stuff. Um, but yeah, it's been a really good and enjoyable thing to do. If you guys want to see more stuff like this in the future, let us know, and we'll try and get it arranged. I, I'm not, I'm not going clear, but. I'm trying to. I'm trying to get you guys the best content possible and do more of this. Hopefully you have enjoyed it. A massive thank you to Nike Football and Liverpool for the opportunity. And all the players as well. They were absolute stars. It's coming over so humble. And it's nice to actually make them, humanise them and uh, bring us back to reality and just show they're actually just normal people who just smash me on table tennis. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. Appreciate it. Take care.